Class of 2020, friends, family, loved ones, at this time we ask you to rise to please join us wherever you are with the singing of our national anthem, which is performed by Jonah Dennis, a junior majoring in both music and chemistry. We also ask that you sing the FIU alma mater conducted virtually by the FIU School of Music. Oh, say, can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight o'er the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there oh say does that star spangled Good afternoon, everyone. Congratulations, graduates. You did it. I am Alexandra Valdez, Student Government President for the Modesto Amadik campus. It is my distinct pleasure to introduce our FIU president. As the first FIU faculty member to ascend to the university's presidency, Mark B. Rosenberg has over four decades of experience in higher education leadership. Dr. Rosenberg was one of the principal architects of FIU's growth and expansion during the past 20 years and played a lead role in the development of both our College of Law and College of Medicine. His efforts as president have pivoted around student success, faculty research and innovation, and fundraising. FIU has been named as a best college to work for four consecutive times during his presidency and is ranked as the second best large employer in the state by Forbes. He was the first chancellor formally selected by the Board of Governors of the State University System of Florida and helped to structure the current two-board system of university governance. He was a presidential appointee to the Task Force on Apprenticeship Expansion, has served on the Board of Directors of the Association of Public and Land Grant Universities, where he chaired the Coalition of Urban Serving Universities and the Commission on Access, Diversity and Excellence. He has also been appointed to three National Academy of Sciences initiatives in the last six years, most recently co-chairing a national roundtable on the future of STEM education. Locally, he is the first academic ever to serve as the chair of the Greater Miami Chamber of Commerce and is a member of the City National Bank Board of Directors. 
He is the author, editor, and co-editor of seven books and numerous scholarly articles on Latin America. Dr. Rosenberg holds a PhD from the University of Pittsburgh and a BA from Miami University of Ohio, where he was a Phi Beta Kappa. He was a Fulbright Research Scholar and is a member of the Council on Foreign Relations in New York. He and his wife are the proud parents of two FIU graduates. I am honored to introduce the fifth president of FIU, Dr. Mark B. Rosenberg. Panthers, class of 2020, this is your special day. And today we say congratulations to you, your families, your abuelas, your abuelos, your friends, your loved ones, and anyone who has supported you in your FIU journey. No doubt, this is a joyous occasion. It's a time for celebration. And I know that we're all living through some tough times for our families, our university, our community, and as a country. Physical distancing and other restrictions put in place for our health and safety have changed how we work, how we socialize. Of course, that means we're unable to gather in person at our Ocean Bay Convocation Center as an FIU family for your commencement. But we can still tell the world class about your accomplishments, about what you've achieved. Today, using the advantages given to us by technology, we've created a virtual commencement ceremony to celebrate you on your special day. And leading up to this special day, we've also enhanced our commencement caravan experience. You, our graduates, were able to walk across the stage with me and Rory personally congratulating you. What a great day that was. And at our voluntary commencement fair, many of you had the chance to purchase those caps and gowns, class rings, FIU swag, and portrait pictures that mean so much to any graduate. Today, you see, it's all about you, your hard work, your goals, your dreams, all turned into accomplishments, real accomplishments. And each of you has brought to the forefront the best of yourselves during this difficult time. As an FIU family, and as the class of 2020, you've shown up for your classmates, for your families, and for your university. You've persevered, you've been committed, and you've succeeded. You have not wasted your shot. And for your FIU, you've given your all. You've shown that this is a strong, caring community that comes together during the most difficult of times. That's the Panther way. Today, as we celebrate you, let's also acknowledge our dedicated and passionate faculty and staff. You see, they have a sense of urgency and commitment to their calling. It's never been more evident than now. They've worked tirelessly to ensure academic continuity despite these trying times. Our faculty and staff, look, we know why we're here, to help raise others up, to help raise you, your families, our community. Indeed, our FIU family, builds futures, starting with yours. So please join me in thanking them. And today, we're a university that is committed to impact, to being a force for good, both locally and globally, to being a university that takes responsibility for community well-being 24-7, 365. So class of 2020 now, more than ever, hold on to hope. Your accomplishments today remind us that better days are ahead. You will be successful. We know this. We know this because as an FIU graduate, you've been taught, you've been advised, you've been mentored, and you've learned from some of the finest, most passionate minds anywhere in the world, our faculty. And you've had a curriculum that is world class, that fostered 21st century critical thinking skills, and critical entrepreneurial skills as well. You've been surrounded by a diverse group of determined, hardworking students who understand the value of an FIU degree. So today, as we acknowledge this incredible milestone in your lives, we want you to make 
Three very modest commitments. First, to be proud of your FIU. This degree that you're receiving, look, it's not for a day, it's for your lifetime. Your degree will always be with you wherever you go. Your FIU will go. Wherever you go, this graduation, these precious moments, they'll go with you. Tell the story of your great education, how your FIU accomplishments have prepared you for the challenges of this 21st century. And finally, support your alma mater. Wear your blue and your gold. Wear your FIU t-shirts. Get an FIU license plate. If you have the ring, show the bling. Take full advantage of your alumni association. Come back home to campus, to your FIU family. So go blue and gold. Go Panthers. Remember class, you make it FIU. Congratulations, class of 2020. Good afternoon, everyone. Congratulations, graduates. My name is L. Panye Hudson, Senior Vice President for Human Resources and Vice Provost for Diversity, Equity, and Inclusion. Today, it is my honor to introduce our FIU Board of Trustees Chairman, Dean Colson. Chairman Colson was born and raised in Miami, Florida. He earned his undergraduate degree from Princeton University and graduated magna cum laude from the University of Miami School of Law. Mr. Colson, a distinguished lawyer in our community, has extensive experience in board fiduciary matters. He is a past chair of the board of the University of Miami, and in 2009, Chairman Colson was appointed to the Board of Governors of the State University System of Florida, where he there served as chair and vice chair of the board from 2010 through 2017. In 2017, the Board of Governors appointed Chairman Colson to serve a five-year term on Florida International University's Board of Trustees. And just this past June, he was unanimously selected to serve as Chairman of the FIU Board of Trustees. Mr. President, graduates, family, and friends, the Chairman of the FIU Board of Trustees, Dean Colson. Hello, Florida International University. On behalf of my colleagues on the Board of Trustees, I would like to extend my congratulations to the Panther Class of 2020 and to their families and friends who are joining us virtually today. Class of 2020, we come together in this virtual commencement to honor your achievements. It takes a great deal of hard work and perseverance to be where you are today, especially during these difficult times. Today, as you receive your degrees, you'll take the first steps down the road of life and your professional careers. Commencement is a day of celebration, but not only for you, our proud graduates. It is a day of celebration for the entire university community. You represent the fruit of our efforts, the creation and transfer of knowledge. That is what universities do. You reflect FIU's success in teaching and graduating students prepared to tackle the challenges of the 21st century and to stand up for what is right. As chairman of the FIU Board of Trustees, I am so proud of the caliber of our graduates. You have faced some unique challenges throughout your university journey, especially in the past few months. This is a graduation you will remember for years to come. It is not your typical celebration, but it is one filled with much hope and anticipation for a better tomorrow. Your commitment and grit are truly inspiring. You, the class of 2020, are our hope for a better tomorrow for our community, state, nation, and world. You are the chosen ones to move us forward with understanding, knowledge, empathy, and vision. I wish you the best in the exciting years that await you and hope that the future brings fulfillment of all your dreams and aspirations. Congratulations and thank you. Hello, I'm Dr. Kenneth G. Furton, Provost and Executive Vice President of FIU. At this time, I wish to recognize the doctoral candidates. Today we celebrate you and all of your accomplishments. We're incredibly proud of your achievements and look forward to what's next for you in your lives and in your careers. 
Now we'd like to provide your family, friends, and guests watching a brief explanation of the importance of the hooding ceremony. The hooding that takes place at a commencement is a special recognition for graduates receiving a doctoral degree. The hood and its academic regalia colors represent the degree or discipline along with the school each student attended. The velvet edge represents the university or college discipline and the satin colors represent the school and the overall size and shape represents the achievement of the degree. All candidates are individually recognized escorted across the stage with their major professor and are hooded by their dean and me and then given their doctoral degree by the president. That moment of hooding celebrates the transformation of a graduate student from a knowledge consumer to a knowledge creator through their intensive study and scholarship, working long hours alongside their mentors in the constant pursuit to create new knowledge. They will now take their places as the academic leaders in their academy and then as well as in the public and private sectors. Mr. President, family and friends, please join me in wishing all of our doctoral students a heartfelt congratulations on their achievement. Congratulations, Honors College Class of 2020. Your hard work has finally paid off. I am Juan Carlos Espinosa, Dean of the Honors College. You are an extraordinary class graduating in an extraordinary time. You have reason to celebrate this special moment. You should be proud of your accomplishments. You have studied, survived exams, you have Zoomed, kept physically distant, and wore masks. You have persisted and thrived, and now you're ready for what comes next. The Honors College provided you with opportunities and experiences to help you obtain critical intellectual and vocational tools. You understand that life is not just a major. Although you must master it, you must go beyond it because you already know the world is unpredictable, complicated, ever-changing, and exciting. Solving complex problems requires interdisciplinary approaches. It requires you to be agile, flexible, adaptable, and fearless, and you are. I am confident you will make an impact in this world where crises also beget opportunities. Go out and change the world. Mr. President, friends and family, I now have the privilege to introduce the Dean of the Robert Stempel College of Public Health and Social Work, Dr. Tomas Gelarte, who will deliver remarks and begin the presentation of graduates. Good afternoon. I am Dr. Tomas Gilarte, Dean of the Robert Stempel College of Public Health and Social Work. I am so proud to celebrate with all of our Panthers such an incredible accomplishment, your graduation, Although we may not be able to gather in person for your special day, I join you through this virtual commencement to let you know that your accomplishments are remarkable and deserve to be recognized. You should be proud of your academic achievements. As your dean, you make me so proud, so Panther proud. You finished this semester successfully showing tremendous flexibility and resilience despite some challenging times over the past few months. I look forward to seeing you in person at a future commencement and congratulating you on stage. Mr. President, I now have the honor to present to you the doctoral, master's, and bachelor's degree candidates from the Roberts Temple College of Public Health and Social Work. They have completed the requirements prescribed for the degrees and are recommended by the faculty of their schools. Mr. President, students, families, and friends, we will now begin the presentation of degrees. Abdulhadi Mohammed S. Abdulwahed. Yunhee G. Adriana Jimenez. Padide Lovan. 
Alnesia Nisbet. Edinosa Oghogo. Stephen White. Nicolette Alfonso. Maria Ariave. Sarah Bin Duran. Jessica Bo. Lace Botelho. Mãe, pai, mão, família, amigos, muito obrigada por me ajudar a chegar nesse diploma e conquistar mais esse sonho. Um beijo enorme a vocês. Adriana Camacho. Jeanette Colwell. Damaris Cruz. Terenda Denard. Thank you to my family and my friends for supporting me. You all are really my villagers and your support carried me. Michael Donahue. Rebecca Fernandez. Amber Goodman. Ashley Goodman. Todd Hardacre. Jakari Harris. Janice Hernandez. Monica Hollyfield. Adriana Hurley. Sean Johnson. Hello guys. I uh, just want to take this time out to say thank you and I appreciate you guys. Um, this is a very important accomplishment for me and I'm very blessed and I'm very grateful. Thank you. Martha Joseph. Jillian Kernan. Conrad Lusagala. Abigail Mahoney. Alyssa Moranges. Rochelle Moses. Jesse Ann Munoz. Kingsley Ogujiofor. I want to thank God first. I want to thank my mom. I want to thank my dad, my brothers, and everyone, family members who supported me, my professors. Thank you so much. Adriana Oliva Caceres. Gabriela Ortega. Julian Ospina. Isabella Penso Mota. Janelle Perez. Christian Poro. Deborah Polito. Ada Ramon. Samuel Roberts. Brenda Rocha. Raquel Rodriguez. Stephanie Saisanas. Marie Lila Schwem. 
Danielle Simons. Franca Sordo. Anthony Stevens. Sabrina Torino. Juliana Toro. I'd like to give thanks first to God because no matter the obstacle, He always made a way. And I dedicate this to the loves of my life, my mom and my dad. Natalie Zar. Francesca Aguirre. Kayla Asquith. Chavelli Aldama. Seha Altinilan. Hi, the day is finally here. I'm graduating. I want to thank my parents, my professors at FIU. It's been an amazing four years. You can do anything you set your mind to. Beatrice Armas. Stacy Bem. Erica Carroll. Carolina Carrasco. Mom, we made it. I love you. Chloe, Robert, all of you guys, Marcelo, thank you for supporting me and loving me through this process. Luann Clerger. Maria Criado. Clara Cruz. Daniel Day. First, I got to thank God, my beautiful wife to be, Jesus. And of course, my parents and my family. I couldn't do it without you. Thank you. Patricia Echeverria. Jessica Etienne. Jameson Xavier. Catherine Garcia. Courtney Henton. Kayla Jolly. Leslie Marrero. Gabriela Matute Pineda. Tyrone McGann. Kevin Morita. Michela Pierre. Bethany Reyes. Enismari Rondon. Suzette Sheffield. Anastasia Shuba. Savannah Supachana. Natasha Vargas. Ariana Vega. Maribele Velasquez. Hey Panthers, put your paws up. Yeah, yeah, we're graduating. Um, I want to thank Jesus, my mom, my dad, my Aunt Betty, R.I.P. Daniel Saunders, um, Gray, Abeloff, and Giordano. Eugenia Wallace. Tiffany Watson. 
class of 2020, are you ready? If you're sitting class, please rise. By virtue of the authority vested in me by the state of Florida, the Florida Board of Governors, and the FIU Board of Trustees, we hereby confer upon each of you the appropriate degree for which you have qualified. You may now move your tassels to the left side of your mortarboards. Congratulations!